what type of water filters do you want to install here in Phuket? I'm with Mr. Woody, who is the CEO of Neo Water Solutions. So we're going to separate it to two. One is municipal water, tap water. That's the tap water that is being provided by local authorities, has already been gone through with some sort of filtration. And then you have the second part, which is the groundwater. So could you start, please, by presenting us what would be the main problems of the water in Phuket? Okay, for the city water, city water is... Normally, the system is okay. Mm -hmm. This is uh, provided by uh, provincial water work okay. municipality. Okay. Uh, and uh, they have the problem just only a particle, only like uh, some dust. The sediment, so sediment. things that we can see in the water. Yes. Yeah. Because they know why. When uh, during they, they, they repair the piping. Yes. The piping is getting all the dust oh, and yeah. all the things. <clears throat> During uh, repair and uh, reconnect again, some mm. soil dust okay, we come to Coming. Yeah. What sort of pipes we have in Phuket? For the modern modern pipe is that they use uh, HDPE, high density polyethylene. So you mentioned that one big thing from the tap water is going to be the things that we can see, the dust, dirt, like hair, leaves, this sort of stuff yeah, in the main like water. Other than uh, mechanical dirt that oh, we can see. Mostly like that. Because mostly like that. Because of uh, they remove of of the harness, they remove actually some harness is uh, is is still there. Still there. Only some only some harness. Maybe a few little. Yeah, uh, yes, very few. Mm. But uh, I but for the iron, iron not much. Not I, much. I, I can say zero. Wow, in municipal water, no yeah. iron. Yes. So they're also maybe doing iron removal yes. at the treatment plants. You know why? Because they have the good good plan they have the 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 good uh, process yes. to, to remove all, all of the it. iron i actually read apparently that uh, they are doing they're cleaning the water up to who standards which yes. is very good yes. very good yes. but you know i also read the other side of things where they're mentioning that the pipes are not very good and they're old so a lot of bacteria is being found in tap water is that true mm, i think can can can, can can, can find sometimes, the, the bacteria. Sometimes depends. Yes. Lucky, not lucky. But but, but okay, they 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 put the chlorine. Chlorine, yes. of course, of course. Uh, chlorine should should be chlorine in the water, yeah. otherwise we will drink bacteria. Mm. It's not good for tummy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, very good. So okay, one one part we mentioned is the mechanical one. Second might be also bacteria we can find in the yes. water. A lot of rust. But this is easy. So if this is the main problem, if tap water, the main problems we have is rust mechanical dirt it should be easy filtration right maybe with uh, this these sorts of cartridges yes yes these very simple yes very really simple so if somebody wants to install a water filter in phuket and they are using tap water mm. municipal water one thing you would recommend for them is to put a mechanical filter just like this one yes okay so this is one part for the mechanical dirt mm. what about for the bacteria and viruses bacteria uh okay if you want to you drink the water you have to install a uh, separate separate yeah separate filter like uh ultra okay. and uh, reverse osmosis okay okay i think uh these two kind of filter it's safe enough for drinking for drinking so this is just for uh not to you uh, ruin your house appliances correct I so this is for all house yes for all house all house but for drinking this is not good uh not good not good okay not recommend okay noted okay so you're using now three stage already yeah we have the big one smaller one and carbon yes what what's the carbon removing uh smell smell and uh some metal Metals, you have metals. Yes. Okay, tell me more about the metals in mm -hmm. the water. Actually, I think it's not, not, not far, not a lot of metal. Not much? Yes, not much. So but mainly the smell. You just smell Yeah, that. smell, sure, because some, sometimes there's, uh, the old pipes make... Uh, the smell. Smell, yes. Yeah, I hope it's only the pipes. Sure, the, only the pipes? Yes. Only? Only the pipes. If you say so. Okay. But the water, <laughs> water is fine. Water is fine, yes, but not for drinking. So, one, two, three, four, full house filtration for an apartment in Phuket. Yes? Perfect. So, moving on to drinking water. Drinking water, we only relying on reverse osmosis systems. Nothing else. Mm, yes. Reverse osmosis, maybe combine it with UV. What do you think? 
That's like good. a level up, yes. you know, very yes, sophisticated. So if you have the budget, I, th I would highly recommend going for reverse osmosis combined with a UV yes. lamp. We covered the municipal part. This was the easy one. And now we're going to be moving on to the groundwater. What would you say for this type of water? What kind of filtration do we need? Uh, iron removal. Iron removal. Yeah. That's number one. What about the dust? That's true. Sure. That's true. Sure. Uh, we will use the sand. Sand? Yes. Okay, so number one for um, groundwater filtration would be a sand filter. Sand filter. Correct. Number two. Uh, I, I, iron fil uh, the iron filter. Iron filter, uh, yes. Now we use the manganese. Okay. Manganese zeolite. Okay. So this is for iron removal. Yes. What are we using here? Manganese. Manganese. Oh, okay. No smell. Doesn't have a smell. So all groundwater has iron in it. All of it, all around Phuket. No matter where you go, wherever, wherever you dig, you're going to find iron. Yes, sure. So iron. Iron is not dangerous for the health, but it leaves like very ugly uh, residue, right? On the faucets, wherever the water is. Yes. Is it dangerous for health? It must. Mm, could be. Yes. Really? Tell me more. Because if iron, uh, much of uh, iron, it will become like uh, the, the sediment in... in Sediment comes inside. Yeah, inside. And then your kidney has to clean it and maybe not good yeah. for the kidney. Better to remove it. Just remove yes. it. We don't want the iron. Yeah. We don't want it. What else are we using for groundwater? Uh, activated carbon. Activated carbon for the smell. For smell. Taste, smell, VOCs. Yes. Yes, all sorts of... This is uh, coconut carbon. So first is this, second is iron. Yes. And then we're having carbon. Mm -hmm. And then... And this... Uh, Hardness? Resin for honey. Hardness, removal. hardness removal. Okay, so if the water is hard, that means if it has excess uh, quantities of minerals, so that's calcium and magnesium, it will leave white stains around your faucets. That's, so this is going to be removing that. And would you say that Phuket has hard water? Mm, I can say 50%. 50%. 50-50, take a chance or test it. I actually I have a few testers uh, that I can mention down below. And if you just want to, it's a very easy DIY test. All right, so our last one is? Uh, last one is anthracite. No, uh, actually, anthracite and uh, sand is uh, same. Same, same. Okay. What is this one? Anthracite. Oh. It's like mineral hole. Mineral holes. So it's working the same as this, but I think this is higher micronage, right? Yes. So big dirt for this, smaller dirt yes. for this. No, no, normally we put together. So as we can see, here we have a lot more, obviously. And number one reason why we have a lot more filtration steps is because, well, this water is unregulated. You don't really know what's in the groundwater. But whenever, you know, it's municipal water, local authorities are obligated to have these sort of standards and to clean it and treat it up to those standards and then send it your way. So municipal water issues, you might have ones that are coming from the pipes because all the trajectory that it has to go through. But for the groundwater, well, nothing is regulated. Yeah. So how are we supposed to know if it's good or not? Are there some sort of standards here in Thailand? Uh, yes, uh, we follow the standard of uh, P uh, PWA. PWA standards, okay. So what are the main things that are being monitored here? So, okay, we have the minerals, we have the salts, bacteria. Let's talk a little bit more about the bacteria. None of these actually are removing the bacteria. What would you recommend as oh, bacteria. a last uh, step? Okay, but last, last step, so we use UV. UV, yeah. This is what actually kills the pathogens, viruses, and bacteria in the water, right? Yes. Can you tell us a little bit more? Uh, that's all. That's all. I stole, I stole your speech. Yeah. Ah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. So, yeah. So, now we can see one, two, three, four, five stages of filtration. Do we have a sixth one? Sixth one. Uh, if you need more, more and more fine for, for the water, because sometimes, you know, this is, uh, this is not, not, not much fine. It's about 100, one, 100 micron, 200 ah, micron. Ah, big. Yes. We need lower. We need at least no. like 10, 25 microns. No, it's zero, 0.0. More? Yes, more. No, why more? You have UV. We have to go to UF. UF. So you're okay. Let's get a UF filter. Can we see UF filter? Ah. I think uh, it's one of the coolest uh, technologies I've seen out there because it does actually manage to, uh, you know, get it down to 0.0. 0.01 0 .0 micron. 0.1 micron. 
Usually these types of filters, so these cartridges. It's about five microns. Five microns. Mic maximum, maximum one micron it goes. Yes. But this is 0 0.001 micron. Yes. I got it. All right, so another interesting thing is that, you know, the, the smallest bacteria, how much is, how much is the size of the smallest oh, bacteria? Bigger than this. That means that this is getting the bacteria. You're being able to catch the bacteria with these types of technology. Mm. But what we are not being able to capture with this is the minerals dissolved in the water. So the salt, so anything that's dissolved in the water that you cannot see that's not a particle, then this is not being able to filter yes. it. That's why we're being able to use resin, which is removing the minerals, or carbon, the VOC. So these are the things that are dissolved in the water that you can't physically see. Yes. Okay, so one, if, two... If you need to remove everything, you have to go for... Reverse uh, osmosis. Yes. yes, yes. So for drinking, we're not changing it. This is only this is only for your entire house. Don't... Even if you have one, two, three, four, five, six filters, you still can't drink this water, right? Not recommended. Not recommended. So... That brings us to number seven, which is for drinking water. Drinking water, okay, we, we go, go for reverse osmosis. Reverse osmosis, we use this, membrane. This membrane. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Membrane is another very genius technology. And why we love membranes is because membrane only accepts the water that's pure, H2O. Anything that's not pure, it's being thrown away. Okay, not true. It's not going through. It's, not, it's just like block, yes. not letting them pass. Okay, so for drinking, only reverse osmosis. This is only the membrane inside the reverse osmosis. I will put a photo of a reverse osmosis system because this is only what goes inside of it. So it's not just this, that what you're looking for. Wow, okay, so many filters, so many things. How can we wrap this up? How can I know which filter do I need or maybe I need all? Uh, depends on uh, requirement. Depends on requirement and depends on the water quality, yes, right? Yes, sure. So maybe we need to send it to a lab test or something. Okay, very good. You know, but there is one thing that I did I noticed that is not in this list. I was checking. Um, I noticed that the PFAS. You have you heard of this new word PFAS in P the water? Yeah, PFAS. P P F A S. What's so this. This is a new contaminant that's been found in the water. It's recently come into the intention of EU and America, recently being standardized. So I was really interested to find out, do you think there's PFAS in the water in Thailand? I don't think so. You don't think so? Yeah. Maybe we should test to know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you. Up.